Hi guys, this is Guycush9 with Let's Play Fable 2. In the last episode, we did a bunch of um, <laughs> random events and stuff like that. We picked up all of our warrants, and now this happens. Stop right there, you little brats! No, <laughs> I will keep moving. <laughs> Shut it, girl. This isn't so, yeah, about this that. is the same guy from the earlier where those warrants you know, you're collecting. Doing well, I want them. That's nah, irrelevant. So he wants the warrants, and this is yeah, yet like another good and evil See? kind of thing. I'm I'm talking Otherwise, over it. I know, but trouble. There'll yeah. be trouble, all right. You take these, and I'll tell our friend what you really want. Yeah, he's trying to take them all first, right, but hard case. What's he paying you? A gold piece? I'll give you a gold right here. Save you to walk back. So yeah, really, it's just a, a question of whether you're lazy or evil or enough. Um, of course, the obviously evil option is to give it right to him. him, and the good option is, of course, to give it back to the now police officer. Talking, but there is on one then. more caveat to this little thing, and she's oh, still talking. Oh, stop! You're Shut gonna up. make break down weeping. Oh, but um, there are events in this game how it. It's hard to describe. Basically, Have you events them? that you do at one point in the game will affect how an area is later on in the game. Thanks. And this is actually one of those events. It's like a brand new thing now, for Fable. It's, it's just really kind of a cool reward. thing. But, but, um, aren't normal circumstances, but yeah, Bowerstone Old piece. Quarter. This is where we are. Bowerstone Old Quarter, or whatever, will That's be severely affected down. whether or not you turn into warrants or not. And you'll Four see, like... Coins. We just need one yeah, I, I did the good option, so you'll see the um, what being good does to the old quarter. But shh, I think mother heard us. Random walking there. You again? I don't want you sniffing around my daughter. Now push off before I call the guards, you animal. Yeah, I I kind of triggered this a little too soon, but basically the guy was trying to uh, talk house, sweet Belinda. nothings into that. To that girl. And clean those floors. They're as filthy as that no good delinquent Monty. Have you looked at yourself? Holy crap, you look ugly. <laughs> oh, the delay there. Alright, so yeah, here is where we get the last of the gold pieces. The love letter. What's the matter with you? Yeah. Oh, little ones. Weird, Rose. My okay, situation there we go. is unbearable. Words can't even begin to describe it. Looks to me like you fancy the girl who lives there, but her mum thinks you're rubbish, so she's locked her away. Uh, I suppose that's the gist of it. <laughs> Why'd you ask me then? Burn. Maybe we could help you. So, yes. Yeah, it's quite obvious. He's going to give us a letter. Uh, you can see, like, to the, fair maiden. the little, oh, little thing up above kind of spoils what the quest is, but... My chest like, like... We'll do it for a gold piece. Yeah, please. Ah, oh, <laughs> but yeah, we get to deliver a letter. Right basically. at the moment. But Belinda's good for it. I'm sure she'll pay you when she receives my letter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's do this. So yeah, the last of the uh, things in the proposal. Darling, run away with me like two doves. We shall rise on lovers. The the sort of uh, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> it's kind of touching, I guess. Get that letter straight yeah. to Belinda. Oh, Don't much. let her mum get it. And yeah, there was he just kind of hinted at um <laughs> one of the ways to end this. This letter's and... awful. Mm -hmm. Listen to this. Darling, <laughs> run away with me. Look, like two. I months, already went over I we just went over this. Loves. Whatever, let's just skip. Knock on doors. What oh do hi. You want? Oh, um, we, we've got a letter. We need one gold for the postage. Yep. Oh, well, why didn't you just say so? All right, so here is the first way that you can end this Come little thing. And, of course, the evil option for this is just give the mom the letter. And, um, on. Wait there while I get the money. And, and why don't she, you touch anything. While she tells us to wait there, if you want to end oh, this the good way, just head upstairs and go straight to the uh, girl. 
I know, I'm being a good Fob again, and like, Maybe some of you probably want to see the evil, of me doing Somewhere. evil Fob, but I don't really like doing evil files. Mainly here. because when you do an evil decision know. in this game, like when they affect the um, terrain this and stuff like wonderful. that, it usually is for the worse. Here's something for your trouble. And, yeah, yeah. Oh, Monty, my little dove. Okay, I guess so... some people's wishes Wait, do come true. Where's she going? Um. You did it. We can buy the oh. music box now. I thought. <laughs> I thought she was gonna hop over the railing and. <laughs> ah, that would have been fun to watch. All right, so now ah, camera. Now we got five gold pieces, and uh, now we can head straight to the. Uh, oh wait. What? Oh. Can't wait to see what it can do. Oh, Monty, I love you. Let's listen to this for no, a while. you don't! He's poor! <laughs> oh, Mother, you're such a shrew. That's why Father left you, and you can't get another man. Ooh. Belinda, you shouldn't talk to your mum like that. Oh, now you're taking her side. Um... What? No! Well, maybe you should marry her instead. <laughs> but you're my one true love. Without you... There are no stars and no moon in my night sky. Yeah. Only the cold, crushing I don't think dark I'm getting sick of, of this. Your absence, so, um, um, my little let's child. just go. <laughs> Alright, so straight to Murgov so we can get the music box. Hello, children. <laughs> Hello. Just love how we sound. We've come to buy the music box. I wonder where the crowd is, though. They kind of just disappeared, didn't they? Very wise, little ones. And we got the music box. The one thing we've been spending over half an hour to get. Or almost half an hour. Trails of energy at our fingertips. Turn the handle, yeah. but mind you go somewhere quiet like. Let's go make our ah, wish. List, I huh? want to do it now. <laughs> okay, so now just a little gold path pops up and just kind of points you to where you need to go for the... the oh, to activate it and then kick the chicken. <laughs> I just love doing that. <laughs> I mean, you haven't played Fable until you kick the chicken. <laughs> all right, and, um, all right, any talking? No. All right. Because <laughs> she keeps talking. I wish. She... I wish. Yeah, one of my favorite songs in this game. Be nice. What? What's going on? Oh no, it's going critical! <laughs> oh. But where did it go? It is magic! <laughs> Why are we still here? Five gold pieces. Let's just go to bed. Oh. That was, was so a nice sure little show, though. It. I had this feeling like, like we weren't going to be stuck in Old Town anymore. Yeah. Why didn't the box take us with it? That was waste, though. Like, I mean, five gold pieces. I mean, like, geez, she hasn't what seen some of the prices here? in the whole game. I'm oh, sure I didn't Dougie! See you. All right, fine. Welcome <laughs> to our little paradise. Oh, Dougie, Dougie. Come on, Sparrow, go to bed. So, yeah, all you gotta do now is just go to bed. Yeah, free fine. <laughs> the quest childhood. Riveting stuff. <laughs> Oh, all right, settle down. There's a nice, uh, angry, stray dog. Quiet, Get him, boy. boy. Now, what are you doing? What do you want? What is he want? I work for Lord Lucian, miss. That's a big And moon. he would very much like to see you in his castle. <gasps> I've been sent to collect you. Oh my god, the wish box worked. <laughs> it did work. I wish I just came said that. <laughs> Come on, little Sparrow. I seem to be preempting Rose a bit. I should probably shut up. <laughs> it's all right, doggy. We're going to Lord Lucian's castle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'll come back Aww. for you. I promise. Aw, doggy doesn't sound too happy. All right, so what? 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 Let me go! <laughs> oh wait, I can pick something up. Okay, Ro oh, <laughs> Rose is sorry. All right. Late century. I managed to find a nice amount of charcoal this morning. So I can finally write again. I saw I finished getting down the short a story about the warrior girl who fights snow monsters. There are always <laughs> existing to that one. So, yeah. 
Sorry, I'm not really saying this. I'm like just reading it a little bit. So this kind of provides a bit of backstory for the um for Rose. So <laughs> finding her diary though, I <laughs> some brother we are, I guess. <laughs> oh well, I do remember you do have to pick up the diary for something. Though. I can't remember what, but um, I don't know. It might be just something that you can just pick up, and I think I skipped the uh, little talking here, so... Let's just go to the castle. And a nice pan to it, too. That's so much snow, though. Alright, and here's um the loading screen. <laughs> We're going to be seeing a lot of this in this project, or at least I will be. Um, yeah, Carol, Castle Fairfax is considered a separate area from Bowerstone in... In fact, I believe there are as many as, uh, three or four separate areas, so... Yeah, this is just one of them. Evening, Jeeves. Here are the children Lord Lucian asked for. Excellent. Hello, young master. Hello, sir. If you'd follow me, please. We look up at this castle every they, day and We can't really do cities. anything here at Castle Fairfax, though. It's just, you know, story inside, stuff. It's so. even more beautiful Man. than I imagined. It is quite wonderful, isn't it? Oh, hey, someone's coming. Oh, it ah, looks a little hello, weird. Hello, Master Garth. Yeah, blue. Ha, <laughs> huh. a man of few words. But as much action, because we will be seeing Garth later on in this oh, in the North Wind, project. And Lord he's actually a pretty cool guy, so since, I like Garth. Since the tragic deaths of... Lady Fairfax and little Amelia. Oh, I heard. That was so awful. Yeah. Yes, well, he I just uh, heard misses so. them terribly. <laughs> so, <laughs> horrible. where does he eat? Actually, he takes most of his meals in his study. He's in there working all hours doing research. What does yeah. he research? Um, on. On history, yeah. mostly. Lord Lucian is quite keen on antiquities of all sorts, but he's chiefly interested in things relating to the Old Kingdom. There was a trader in Old Town who said his stuff was from the Old Kingdom. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm sorry yes. I'm not talking a lot. This is Lord Lucian it's not a lot of important stories, that. especially the cutscene coming up we ahead. And I'm probably not. I'm and probably gonna wish. just now we're here. stop talking during that thing because well, it's wonderful. a very, very now, serious and important Lucian, scene. So I want to give it the, the respect it deserves. It kind of sets up Lord, like most, a, a good deal of the um, plot of the yes, game. Sir. So I'm I'm just gonna stop and talking during that moment. Lady Fairfax or Amelia. Because it is important. So yeah, I'll 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 tell you when I'm gonna stop talking. Here we are, Lord Lucian. The children are here. Ooh, neat stained glass. So we'll go. What? She faced through the door! <laughs> oh my god. That was funny. Oh, hi. Children, it's come to my attention that you have some sort of magic box. Oh, he I did. Hey, hey, he's pushing me. It vanished, my lord. We were winding it up and we made a wish and then it started to glow and it disappeared. Yeah, it was a rip off. After you used it. Yes, my lord. The man who sold it to us said it was magic. Mm -hmm. The box is of no interest to me. What's remarkable is that you were able to use it. Mm -hmm. What was your wish? Oh. <laughs> well, speak up. What did you wish for? It's not like you're coming out. <laughs> to live in All right, a I'll castle. Stop. Like this one. <laughs> Perhaps that could be arranged. I am working to rebuild... Well, I'm working on something wonderful, for which I need individuals with particular talents. Hmm. Let us find out if you possess them. Would you kindly stand in the circle, please? Um... I promise it won't hurt you. And once I stand in the circle, I'll officially stop talking, so... Yeah. Alright, so for pretty much a good deal of time, I'm going to be quiet now because it's important stuff, so here you go. What's that? Okay. All right, there you go. Nothing to worry about. It's true. Your blood. You are heroes. Heroes? You mean like in the old stories?
Lucian disappeared from Castle Fairfax that night, certain that those who might stand in his way were dead. But some grief is so great, even death may keep its distance. And so the boy survived. Days later, far from the dark alleys of Bowerstone, life slowly returned to his small broken body. The boy awoke to a familiar face watching over a strange bed. He reached out for the comfort of the dog's warm fur, ready to take his first steps in a new life. Ten winters blanketed Albion. Ten summers filled the air with the sounds of insects and laughter. With time, the boy's pain turned to strength. His grief became will. A will to change the world and to avenge the death that still haunted his every dream. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that. Nice little break for me. Ah, yeah. Oh, there hi. you are. And your faithful friend, too. And now we're all grown up, Many too. Ago, How about I that? I promised I would help you avenge your sister's death. That so, day yeah. has come. Yeah. Today, you leave the safety of this camp and seek out Lucian. The journey will not be easy. There's a chest and near your caravan. Stop! Inside that might prove useful. So yeah, and we won't be going today Meet because gates, looking at my clock, I have spent a lot of time in the childhood thing. They have cutscenes. But yeah, we're all grown up and now the dog will actually follow us too, which is I'll get into that next time because I'll go of the uh, pause screen right now. There's a save, there's a thing for quests and abilities, items, weapons, clothing, logbook, and options. But I'll save everything else for later. This is Guy Christian 9 with Let's Play Fable 2. In the next episode, the game begins in earnest. I'll see you then, guys.